Hey guys, it's me, Lego Master 627, and today I am back with another backyard video. So today, guys, it is Sunday, July 7th, 2019. And today in the backyard, um, if you heard in the Sunday vlog, I think we're gonna be doing like a project or something. But however, I don't want to waste the entire time doing a project. No, we can do other things after that. But, yeah. Okay, who knows what we're going to get into after we do a project, but let's just get into it and find out. So, hold on, I'm just making sure. I think there was something on my phone right there. There we go. <laughs> um, anyway, guys, the time I'm recording this is 1.53 p.m. And my phone is 40%, so we're good. By the way, as you guys can see, the workshop anniversary is still here after two days. And the reason it is is just because I forgot to take it down yesterday. Um, but yeah. Um, that's really cool. I'm actually going to have to throw out these. Also, as you guys can see, I wasn't joking with you guys in the Sunday log when I said that these projects were gone. But as you guys can see, there is the 17 pin. I'm obviously going to keep it there um, until, well, I decide to get rid of them. Um, but that's probably not going to be for a little while. Anyway, um, let's actually put this sign somewhere so I obviously don't lose it. Uh, what box, though? Oh yeah, that's one messed up pin. Heck, I think all the pins are messed up. I think all of the pins are messed up. But who cares, they were only just for that day. We also gotta throw out this. Well, I'm just gonna put it down there. Uh, holy frick. This could be more harder than I thought. Ow! Kind of hit the table there. Um, yeah, let's start cleaning this up. Uh, I'm going to put the noodles back in the chest in just a minute. Hold on. There we go. We got them now. So yeah, let's go ahead and go put both of these noodles back in the chest. And then we can start our projects. Yay! Uh, let's go in here. And look, there's all the flamingos on that float along with the peacock float. Actually, I don't think we even have any room, so... I guess it's there for now. Until we find a place to put them. Who knows where, but we definitely need to find a place soon to put all the noodles in. Alright! Let's go back to the workshop now. You know, I honestly thought that this would be uh, a little more summer themed. Um, by the way, I do know what the next event in the backyard is. I'll reveal it to you guys um, very soon. Whoa! Hey, I never saw this before. Hey, this is new. Look at that. I never saw this before in the backyard. How did this get here? Who knows? Anyway, let's get back to business and actually start our project. So, let's go in here. Um, yep. Oh, I should also put the 17 pin. Um, right, like, I think like right here, maybe. There we go. So. What we're going to do is, we're going to do this. And yes, as you can see, the rock jar was up there. Uh, uh, oh, hold on, I need to put my phone down. Now I could just pause this, but... There we go. I didn't even need to pause it because it was that quick. So now it's here. Although normally I would put the jar over there. 
but today I decided. Let's just put it over here. We'll add some more wood to this very soon. Just give me a sec. Just gonna put all the rocks here first. Alright, so. What we're gonna do is, for this project, I'm gonna go get all of the rings. Let's actually go get those, actually. The reason why I want to add the rings to the project now is just because it makes it a little more, uh, you know, creative in a way. Look, I don't know why, but it just does. Who knows? It may not become a permanent thing, which I kind of hope it doesn't become a permanent thing where I always put the rings on projects. But maybe at least for this one. All right, let's open this up. And grab all these rings. There they are. Where's the green one? I want to know. Uh, there's the third orange noodle. I could have used that for the workshop anniversary. Come on! Oh, this thing's too heavy. Hold on. Be right back. Wait! I know what to do with the rings. A ring hunt. You know, when I always do, used to do those ring hunts where I hunt down the rings in random episodes whenever I felt like doing them. Well, the last time we ever did a ring hunt was... May 1st, 2019 for day one of the 7 Days of Fun 2019. It's now July 7th, so that's over two months ago since the last time we did a ring hunt in the backyard. It's time to do one again, but let's finish our prog our project first. But let's actually grab these because um, I do need them. So, yep, I got all the rings. I got, hold on, one. Hold on, I'm trying to look. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, six rings. Actually, I think that's seven. I think that's seven rings. Yep, seven rings. <laughs> Let's throw them! <laughs> but really, let's just pick them up in the order. Yeah, sorry about that. Uh, thing is sideways. <laughs> Oh man, this is too much fun. Really, let's go throw them all on the project table and see how how good it is. See, yeah, this is gonna be fun. And then after this, we'll use them for a ring hunt. Cause honestly, it's about time we do another ring hunt. <laughs> all right, here we go. There we go. All right, we need another piece of wood for our project. It's actually been an entire week since the last time we did a project. It's time for another. Uh, come on. There we go. God. Trying to find good ones. Uh, there we go. We got this one, uh, and we need one more for the um, for this one, and that'll be this one right here. Um, 
Now, I think we only need like one more piece of wood to finish this project off. Let's move that right there. Now, wait. This project is actually going to be kind of a twist. Because what we're going to do is we're going to be doing like... Okay. So you want to know how this is going to work, right? Well, we do one like this. We're like, that's right there. Yeah, we do that. Uh, hold on. Yep, golden rock. And we do that. However, of course, we're not done. Because I will be adding in this. Yep, there we go. How's that for a perfect twist? So far, at least. Oh, right, we're going to add racks before we add in the next ones. Actually, let's kind of turn this actually, like, right there. Actually, let's just keep it the same. Wait, I found two good rocks. There we go. Um, let's replace this one. And yeah, let's go with this one. And this one. Now next up, we will be doing this one right here. Yep, this one right here. And then we're going to go like across from there. So watch. Uh, yeah, after this, we will do a full-on ring hunt. Oh, and by the way, we can put this rock here now. Right over there. Actually, let's kind of do it like this. There we go. That's better. No, clearly. It is. There we go. I think we need one more piece of wood to finish this off. Oh, come on! Eh, at least that's there. And of course, it had to be the big one that had to fall off. There we go. Um, there we go. One more rock. Let's end it off with a gold rock. Yeah. There we go. Wait. This needs a little more. Because what I realize is that this actually doesn't look like enough. Which is why we're going to add in this very label right here. It's going to be this. You see this? Yeah that we're going to be adding that what it makes it more interesting although it will be kind of hard to walk around although i will be taking down this project in the next episode on july 10th so this will be here for three days eh, hold up there we go Yep, on Wednesday, which is when the next episode comes out, I will take down this project. I think even on camera, actually. Funny enough. I think even on camera I'll even take down that project. But guys, uh, maybe I should add one more thing. Maybe I should add this. Whoa, look at this. Okay, let's go. Yep, after this final piece, I will do the um, ring hunt with all those glory rings over there, which I still love these rings today. 
Seriously, I need to do more backyard videos where I do the ring hunt. That's probably going to be in the next episode. Probably another ring hunt. You see that moving right there? <laughs> Let's put a gold rock in the middle. Although, where even is one? Come on, let this be it. No! Well, at least it counts. That's something. Ah, 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 it's gonna fall down! <laughs> so close to finishing this project. I think I only just need like two more rocks. Let's end it off with these white ones and guys with that being said our official project for today is done what do you guys think this looks incredible i love it all right now it's time for the ring hunts. So let's go ahead and grab all the rings. And let's go ahead and get out of here. Get out of the workshop, to be exact. And let's go hide these all over the backyard. Let's go. All right, I've hit all of them. So let's go. So, if you guys know where all of these are hid, let me tell you. Here are the areas that I hid all the rings. Filter and wood pile, tree next to the garden. Pond view, dry pot area, shed, workshop, and the garden. So let's begin. All right, first ring. If you're wondering, where is it hid? Right here in this pile. Well, by the way, the order, like in the order that I showed you guys all the screenshots for the areas is the exact order of where all the rings are. So if you're curious to know like where are like the brute, like the blue ring, for example, this is probably gonna be the most hidden ring ever, but guess where it's hid? Right there. <laughs> Hold on, got it, and <laughs> all right, that's one down. Six to go. <laughs> Alright, this next ring should be pretty obvious to you guys by now. It is in the tree next to the garden. But you might be wondering, where? Well, I got the answer for you. It's right behind the tree! All right, let's move on to our next ring. Right over here in um, the pond view. If you guys to know where the ring is, you probably just saw it, but it is hidden right there in this tree. Um, now that's the only place I could hide it because I just couldn't find anywhere else in this tree to hide it. I could have hit it like right there. However, um, I just, didn't. So, anyway. <laughs> Alright! Green ring next! Oh. Let's see where that is. So it is here in the tripod area. However, you might wonder where. Well, it's actually pretty simple to know where it is, actually. It is right up here! Alright, next ring is here in the, um, shed. Oh, good, I thought he was, um, playing with one of the stuff that I had, but good, he's playing with as well. Nice. Okay, that's good, alright. So you guys mind, you're like, well, it's here in the shed, of course, but if you're curious to know where it actually is, let me tell you. <whistles> yup, right up here. <laughs> Let's grab it. Boom! <laughs> oh, 
uh, this next one should be obvious to you guys. Uh, I just said that it was hitting, the purple one was hidden in the workshop. And it's right here, inside this jar. You might be wondering, how the heck was I able to get inside the jar? Simple. Because this thing is like, so like, dead or something. So, there we go. That was easy. <laughs> Alright, there's only one ring left in this entire ring hunt. And that is none other than Orange. Oh, this is going to be fun. Lots of fun. It's right here in the garden. It's literally right here in the garden. But if you're curious to know, like, where is it in the garden, simple as that. It, it, none other than, ugh, it's right here. <sighs> all right, we have now collected all the rings, so let's go put this in the workshop. This was actually a lot of fun. Let's actually make it a good one for this final part. All right, three, two, one. Complete. So guys, all this time, if you're wondering why I was doing the ring hunt, it was just because I wanted to do it again as a classic. If you don't know, I've always done ring hunts in the series before, as I probably mentioned before I even started this ring hunt today. But I've done this a lot throughout the series, and let me tell you, it's actually pretty fun when I do, like, ring hunts and stuff. Well, I just wanted to recreate that today just because uh, I don't get to do the ring hunts anymore because, well, I'm way too busy with other stuff, and there's so many events to go on throughout the month. By the way, if you're curious, there's only two events this month, 4th of July and another one to be announced in this week's update video. Trust me, this one's going to be good. The event that's coming up later this month, before the New York trip on July 24th, will be amazing. Of course, I'm going to have to do it before July 24th, because on July 24th, I go to New York for the New York trip 2019. So this event will be before I go there. <laughs> so it'll be probably around next week. But I'll announce it to you guys fully in um, this week's update video on July 10th. Um, so yeah. Anyway, um, well, we're done. So, guys, I guess we're just gonna end the video now. So, guys, that wraps up today's backyard video like that right here. Um, if you guys enjoyed, please remember to like and subscribe to my channel. Yes, I finally actually say it for once. <laughs> um... But yeah, just again, like and subscribe. There is one more video I have for you guys planned later, and that is Legos Island Summer 2019 items 35, 36, and 37. Alright guys, goodbye!